Hi, this is Dr. Gary and welcome to the Daily Tune-Up today. Today I want to talk to you about the ability we have to adapt. You know, as human beings, we are so unique. I've heard people say if dolphins had hands and feet, they could probably do more than us. And that could be true. However, they don't and we do, which means we are actually the superior species on this planet as we know it today. Who knows what they can find lurking in the bushes in the future. But today, man is, is it. Which leaves us with a responsibility. Now, globally, that's a big deal. But when we bring it down to our backyard and into our home, that's you. And that means we all have the ability to adapt. And the ability to adapt is a very, very unique capability that only human beings have. Some, some animals have it, of course, and animals can be trained, we know that. However, as a human being, our ability to adapt to all kinds of things is amazing. What continues to stump me is when people come and work with me, whether they want to lose weight, whether they want to stop smoking, whether they want to work through depression and moodiness, they act like they can't adapt. And they act like sometimes that it's the most difficult thing in the world to even accept the fact that they can change. Each one of us have the capability to change. When we change, it's not that big a deal. But you would think that it is the biggest thing in the world when you ask a person to change a small habit or a small behavior. During this holiday season, this is the time when we start formulating New Year's resolutions. But here's the funny thing, most New Year's resolutions are blown out the door two weeks after we start them because of our inability to adapt to a new behavior. Here's a little trick. First of all, one of the best things you can do if you want to change a behavior, especially something you want to do next year different than this year, and I suggest next year is the year to do it because there are going to be huge changes socially, spiritually, and even earth changes on the way. So the idea here is, is to understand that if you will visualize yourself doing what you want to do, and do that about three times in a row for about seven days in a row, you now have created the avenue and the neurons and the synaptic process inside your head to start adapting and changing. It's that easy. And if you'll add one little component to it that's gonna even make it better, feel it. Really create an emotion with it. Really feel it, but visualize it three times a day with passion and do that about seven days in a row, you're gonna start adapting to a new behavior, whether it's losing weight, because we really don't want to tell ourselves we're gonna go on a diet and lose weight, we wanna focus on becoming thinner and healthier. So work on that and really pay attention to your ability to adapt and do new things. Otherwise, we could not see human beings doing all the crazy things that we do. So today, let's really, really focus on that, adapt to that, and give ourselves a chance by first telling yourself, I can do this. See yourself do it, and then feel how good it feels to do it. Do that three times in a row, seven days in a, in a, in a row, and you're gonna find, you're gonna start adapting to that behavior. So I also wanna thank all of those who, who watched our NeuroNuts program. We've had a lot of response from that worldwide. It's the most response I've ever got on anything I've ever done. I appreciate you watching. I even got an email all the way down in, in Mexico that said it actually moved someone. And I appreciate that. And that's exactly what our intention is. So the next NeuroNuts program is going to be January 9th. And we look forward to having you join us live. And those of you who did, we appreciate it. Spread the word. And in the meantime, Adapt. Until tomorrow, this is Dr. Gary wishing you a very adaptive day. Bye-bye.